Lombard MMA Fit is a kickboxing fitness workout. Fit stands for fitness, intensity, and technique. There are four levels in Lombard MMA Fit. Level one, the comeback. Level two, the breakthrough. Level three, relentless. And level four, invincible. Level three, relentless. These are more advanced kickboxing techniques with combinations including calisthenics. This is at a above average or higher fitness level. These workouts are unique in that the goal is to help build a participant's kickboxing skills and self-defense skills while increasing their strength and fitness levels. Workouts are for all ages, abilities, and fitness levels. The goals of Lombard MMA Fit are to increase the individual's physical and mental confidence through self-defense and kickboxing techniques. These are authentic kickboxing techniques. Train hard, train safe, have fun. Welcome to Lombard MMA Fit. Have a great workout. This is level three, relentless workout number three. This is Miranda, this is Ariel. We're gonna start out with a combination, jab, cross, hook. Jab, cross, hook, and then bounce in between. If your left foot is forward, left jab, right cross, left hook, bounce in between. Keep moving in between, jab, cross, hook. Learn how to come out of a, a movement to a set position so you can strike with speed and power and leverage. One, two, three. Rotate on the cross and hook. Sit down those punches, bend those knees. Exhale on your strikes. Good three count punch combination. One, two, three. Elbows tight. If I put my right foot forward for your lefties, jab, cross, hook with your right foot forward. Right jab, left cross, right hook. Right jab, left cross, right hook if your right foot is forward. One, two, three, bounce it out. One, two, three, bounce it out. Okay, next minute we're going jab, cross, bicycle. Chop those feet, keep those hands up. Your hands will be going from your temple ear area to straight ahead, full extension. Developing your eye, hand, foot coordination. Hand speed, shoulder endurance and high volume of the straight punch technique, your jab and cross. Breathe within, not heavy exhales, just breathe within. Chop those feet, quick feet. Developing that eye-hand foot coordination. Last few seconds, chop those feet, quick feet, and time, bounce it out, shake your shoulders out if you need to. Combination, we're going rear uppercut hook to a knee. And those knees can be long knees, extend it straight out, or a straight up knee. Rear uppercut hook to a knee. Rear uppercut hook, straight up knee. It's called a quick knee or high knee. Rear uppercut hook, straight up knee. So if the really in close tight to you, it's go straight up. If they're at a longer range distance from you, it's more of a long knee, straight out knee. One, two, and three. If I put my right foot forward, left uppercut, right hook, left knee. Left uppercut, right hook, left knee. Bounce it out. One, two, quick knee, high knee. Remember that high knee goes to your shoulder. Hit through the target. And a high knee. Okay, and now we're going to knee bounces. Three to a side. Get those knees up as high as you can, at least above your hip line. Outside, 45, inside. Outside, 45, inside. One, two, three. Work those angles, good for hip flexor strength, flexibility, leg endurance, leg strength, kicking speed, overall cardiovascular endurance, muscular endurance. 
Again, three to a side. Outside, 45, inside. Outside, inside. Two, three, one, two, three. Last few seconds. Good, bounce it out. Combination, jab, cross, jab, right foot jab. So if your left foot is forward, jab, cross, jab, right kick. Left jab, right cross, left jab, right kick. Going to the high line, the head, with punches, to the body, even to the hip, to the knee, even to the head, with your kick. One, two, three. Right foot jab. Bounce out in between, light on your feet. One, two, three. Kick on the end. If I go my right foot forward, right jab, left cross, right jab, left kick. Jab, cross, jab, left kick. Exhales. Get those exhales in there. Stamina, power. And moving on to the next drill, double bounce step. Forward and back, side to side. Right foot forward, left foot forward, feet squared. Shake shoulders out if you need to. Then get them right back up. Shoulder endurance. Toe heel. So at one point, your toe and your heel are coming together. Toe heel, footwork. Developing that eye foot coordination, foot agility. Just side to side. Next footwork, alternates. Side to side, push left. Push right, side to side, left. Right. Side to side, right. Side, left. Hands up, shake them out if you need to. Side to side. This is a push step. Side to side bounce, pushing left, pushing right. Okay, combination. We're going lead snap kick, cross, hook, cross. So if your left foot is forward, left snap kick, cross, hook, cross. Exhaling, elbows tight, hands up. Keeping those elbows tight, chin tucked. Left snap kick, right cross, left hook, right cross. Bounce it out. Good strong exhales. If I put my right foot forward, right snap kick, left cross, right hook, left cross. Bounce it out. One, two, three, and four. We call it low to high combination. Low with the kick, and then high to the head with the punches. One, two, three, four. Bounce it out. Okay, next drill, we're going power hooks. All power hooks on the left. All power hooks on the left. Really turn that over. Rotate, turn your hip. Core strength. Good tight hook. Exhales. Hook and set yourself. Hook, set yourself. Here we go. Nice, good power. Getting used to punch with some velocity and some power. Okay, other side, right hooks. If your left foot is forward or your rear hook. Nice power. Bend those knees. Everything's tight. Good rotation. Bring that opposite hand back to your ear. Protection, power, core strength, technique, strong exhales. Last one, bounce it out. Okay, combination, jab, cross, lead elbow, rear elbow. Left foot is forward, left jab, right cross, left elbow, right elbow. Rotation on those elbows. One, two, three, four. Bounce it out. Shake the shoulders out if you need to. Jab, cross, left hook, your left elbow, right elbow. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Put some speed behind it if you can. The faster and harder you go, the more you get out of the workout, the more intense it is. But you go at the pace that's comfortable for you. 
and then build it up. Hey, if my right foot's forward, I'm going left jab, right cross, left elbow, right elbow. Left, cro left jab, right cross, left elbow, right elbow, right elbow, left elbow. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Bounce it out. One, two, three, four. Okay, next drill, knee bounces. Two to a side. Two to a side, switching your angles. Remember, you have outside, 45, or inside. Outside, 45, or inside. And you change them up. Going two to a side. One, two. One, two. Mix it up. Outside, inside, 45, inside, 45, inside, outside, inside. Just mix it up. Get those knees higher than your hip line. Eye foot coordination. Kick speed. Leg endurance, muscular endurance. Cardio, core. As you bring that knee up, you kind of crunch that midsection. Works that core. Come on, change those angles. Okay, set yourself. And we're going to combination. Cross, hook, cross. Bounce it out. So if your left foot is forward, right cross, left hook, right cross. Elbows tight, chin tucked, good fluid motion, three count punch combo. One, two, three. Good strong exhales. Rotate on each punch for power. Power and range. Bend those knees, sit down on those punches. If I put my right foot forward, if you lefties, left cross, right hook, left cross. Left cross, right hook, left cross. Bounce it out. Shake your shoulders out if you need. Right back up. One, two, three. Exhale on the punches. Exhale on those punches. Okay, next drill. Speed burpees to a snap kick. Alternating sides each time. So a quick speed burpee, back up, right snap kick. Speed burpee, left snap kick. And just working side to side. Get up on the ball of your foot with those snap kicks. And exhale. Fully extend those legs out. Exhale on no strikes. Last few seconds. Bring that knee up high and snap. Knee up high and snap. Hands up. Hands up. Okay, bounce it out. Now we're going combination. Rear uppercut, hook, cross. Bounce it. Rear uppercut, hook, cross. Bounce it out. One, two, three. Elbows tight, hands up. One, two, three. Bounce it out. Shake it off if you need. Elbows tight, knees bent. Slight bend those knees, rotation on each strike. Good strong exhales. Your left hand, right foot's forward, left uppercut, left uppercut, right hook, left cross. Left uppercut, right hook, left cross. Bounce it out. Bounce it out. One, two, three. Bounce it out. Next drill, speed burpee to a knee. It can be a high knee or a long knee. So speed burpee and a knee, yep. Speed burpee, and a knee. It can be long or straight up. It can be straight up, bring that knee to your chest and switch sides. Or it could be your long, where you're going outward. And alternate sides, right to left. Again, straight up or long. Straight up, 
or long. Long's a, more of a range to the midsection, staying through, and the high knee's more in tight, can go to the body or the head. Okay, bounce it out. Next combination, jab, rear uppercut, hook. Bounce it out. Jab, rear uppercut, hook. Three punch combos. One, two, three. Everything's tight, compact. No waste in motion. One, two, three. Rotation, bent knees. Sit down on those punches. More power, more leverage. If I put my right foot forward, right jab, left uppercut, right hook. One, two, three. One, two, three. Shake those shoulders out when needed, but keep bouncing. Jab, rear uppercut, hook. Okay, we're going into knee bounces, singles. So side to side, singles, changing the angle. Remember, we have outside, 45, or inside, and you mix them up. Knees above your waistline. Knees above the waistline. Stretch those hips out. Leg strength. In any sport, you need leg endurance, leg strength. Once your legs give out, it affects the whole game. Bounce those out. Change the angles. Hands up, shake them out if you need. Then get them right back up. Okay, next drill. Bounce it out. We're going jab, cross, jab, right snap kick. Right snap kick. One, two, three, right snap kick. Bounce it out. Left jab, right cross, left jab, right snap kick. If your left foot is forward. One, two, three, four. Bounce it out. One, two, three, four. Bounce it out. Good exhales. Get that knee up high on your snap kick. That allows your foot to go higher. Again, through the target. If I put my right foot forward, right jab, left cross, right jab, left snap kick. Jab, cross, jab, snap kick down below. High to low. One, two, three, snap kick. Last combo, one, two, three, snap kick. Okay, knees. Clinch your knee, five to a side. Clinch that person's head up, and five to the right, and then five to the left, and repeat. Bring that head into your shoulder. So now bring your hands down here to your shoulder. Pulling that person's body into yours and driving that knee through. Five to the side. Get that knee up high. And get those knees up high. High as you can, flexibility, strength, eye foot coordination. Bounce on your posted foot. Clinch that person's head up, dominate that clinch. Okay, set, combination, hook, cross, hook. Bounce it out. Hook, cross, hook. Developing those hands. Developing your boxing. Hook, cross, hook. One, two, three. If your left foot is forward, left hook, right cross, left hook. Bounce it out. Now if your right foot's forward, right hook, left cross, right hook. Bounce it out. One, two, three, and bounce. One, two, three, and bounce. Again, if your right foot is forward, right hook, left cross, right hook. Rotation on each. Good rotation, power, and range. 
power and range, hook, cross, hook. Develop good, fast, quick hands. One, two, three. Repetition, high repetition. Exhale. Last combo, good, bounce out. Last minute, speed burpee to a lead elbow, rear elbow. Speed burpee, left elbow, right elbow. Speed burpee, elbow to elbow, side to side. One, two. One, two. Calisthenic to a sport specific technique. Kick out, lead elbow, rear elbow. Keep everything tight. Everything tight. Hands up. Left to right. Left to right. Or you can also do right to left. It doesn't really matter. Just side to side. One, two. Last 10 seconds. One, two. One, two. Last one. And shake it out. All right, we just completed level three relentless workout number three. Get those abs and push ups in, and we'll see you for the next workout. Hello, everyone. My name is Bruce Lombard, owner of Lombard MMA and creator of Lombard MMA Fit. Hope you had a great workout. Don't forget to get your push ups in and get your ab routine in by following Lombard MMA Fit ab routine workouts on YouTube. To help increase your kickboxing technical comprehension and ability and take your kickboxing to the next level, visit LombardMMA.com, where you can become a Lombard MMA member and have access to hundreds of instructional videos to help your basic boxing and kickboxing techniques. Thank you for training with us at Lombard MMA Fit. Leave a message in the comment section below with any questions.